going on everybody? It's Alex from Everything for iPod and today I have an app review of an app called Cycloramic. It's available in the App Store for 99 cents and it basically allows you to take panoramic videos on your iPhone 5 hands-free. You don't even need to touch your phone to take them. Again, this is pictures, not videos. Um, basically, what you do is place your iPhone down on a polished surface. It will vibrate and move itself. You can use the front-facing or rear-facing camera and choose between a 360-degree, 720-degree, or 1080-degree spin. You can also view your uh, videos that you have taken with Cycloramic from the app. So I set the iPhone down on the table and now I'm going to hit go. Now one nice feature is that when you hit go you get 3 seconds to kind of stabilize your phone before it starts to spin. Now it doesn't actually record audio because if it did you would hear the vibrating noise in the video and again this does take videos not pictures. And again also you cannot take landscape videos it's only portrait videos. So as far as uses for this app I don't really see how you could use it um, as far as taking a realistic video but it is kind of fun to play around with and definitely in my opinion worth 99 cents. Now Cycloramic suggests that you use it on a glass surface or marble really anything shiny. I am using it on my wood desk which is flat and smooth. It did work and I also did try it on a marble floor and that seemed to work as well. I didn't really find a difference between the two so really any flat surface you use will work. One thing I didn't find that worked was I actually tried it on a piece of plastic and it didn't spin at all. Now I am using a tempered glass screen protector and that doesn't seem to affect it but you will have to remove any case you might have before trying to use this. Also some skins that wrap around the edges of your phone might affect this such as the Zag Invisible Shield. Because the iPhone 5 scratches so easily, some people were worried about getting scratches on the bottom of their iPhone while using this app. Personally, I didn't find any on mine, and it wouldn't bother me even if I did. If you don't use the app too often, you probably won't see anything, but if you use it multiple times a day, over time, you might see a little bit of wear and tear, but nothing too noticeable. Also, one thing you have to be careful of is not to bump into the table while you are using this because it might fall over. Cycloramic can only be used with the iPhone 5, but Egos Ventures, the company that actually makes the app, says that they are working on a version for the iPhone 4 and 4S, which should be coming soon, as well as they are also uh, working on adding photo panoramic mode to the app besides the video mode. Here's some actual test footage from my iPhone 5. As you can see, the video is a little bit jittery and the focus also does get a little bit messed up. So as far as uses, like I said, I can't actually see myself using this too much, but if they do add a photo panoramic mode, I will definitely use this all the time to get that perfect panoramic shot. That's it guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button and the subscribe button. Thanks and I'll catch you in my next video.